This is your daily program, National Talk Black. Have your say in Yarn Up Strong, 1 800 422 416. Call the number Yarn with yours truly, Trevor Tim Trendy, Trev Murray from the Curry, your host for your daily program, National Talk Black. And we're live at the First Nation Radio Station here in Cairns, BBM Bummer Brit Media, 98.7 FM. And we go across the nation thanks to NERS, National News Radio Service. Have your say in Yarn Up Strong, your mob. Now, funding pool is being established to support the Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander community, controlled sector in its delivery of vital services and commitments under the new. National Agreement on Closing the Gap. The uh, Commonwealth Government will contribute uh, $46.5 million over four years, with the Victorian Government adding an additional $3.3 million to the funding pool. We're, we're going to catch have a yarn with uh, with uh, the uh, uh, ADA President. ADA is the Australian Indigenous Doctors Association, and the ADA President is uh, Associate Professor Chris uh, Rulla Baker on the line. Um, good morning. How are you, Professor? Good morning. Thanks very much for having me on. Thank you very much coming to the program. I always say money's not everything, but I rank it right up there with oxygen. Look, it's a tool, a fantastic tool for this fantastic um, organisation in regard to uh, First Nation health. So you've got to be excited about that, eh? Yes? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it's uh, it's a big agreement uh, moving forward. And embedded in the middle of it, of course, is the principle of self-determination. Mm. And all our big bodies have come together and, and really met at an important point to improve the health and well-being of all our people. Well, exactly, and uh, the National Agreement on Closing the Gap, um, uh, still a lot of work to be done in uh, uh, education, employment, and, of course, in, in health, so uh, a very important pillar. Definitely, definitely. I, I think the, the outstanding part of this agreement is the fact that we had over 40 peak bodies who came together mm. uh, and collaboratively worked out the direction that we want and then took that to the federal government. And to be fair, the federal government were responsive with that as well. After the original close the gap proposal yep. uh, that, that you know, the peak bodies felt weren't adequate, the federal government uh, was actually, you know, listened, listened and, and sat down with the task force who done all of that work pulling this together. And uh, now we've got, uh, you know, a funding promise there. Now it's about working out the details, like you said, and moving forward and actually delivering on what we need. Exactly, and look, we as First Nation people, we've got the uh, answers uh, uh, to the solutions, uh, to the problems, and uh, and we just need to be uh, holding the reins in regarding steering the ship forward and uh, the fact that we are at the table and uh, the government have uh, listened to what we're saying. Uh, look, that, that, that's a good thing, uh, a small step in the right direction, yep. Yeah, and you're absolutely right. It's about that principle of not telling us what to do, but, but mm. us actually making decisions about finding solutions to, to, you know, our own pathways and and, uh, and us moving forward. And we're moving together collaboratively. So collaboratively. So rather than a, a you know, a top down with mm. the government saying this is this is what's best for you and spoon feeding us. Exactly. Uh, it's about moving forward in a much more mature way to find solutions together. And when you talk about uh, amount of money like so, $46.5 million, another $3.3 million from the Victorian government, uh, yeah, a big shout out to the government in that sense, but uh, that's not an expense, that's investment. And uh, if you look at a healthy Australia, and especially black Australia, then it, well, it, it, it brings down the, those sort of figures, doesn't it? In the long term, and that's exactly it, you've, you've hit it on the head. It's about long-term investment in society, the long-term investment in Australia, and making sure that our people find the position, the rightful position, uh, where we should be in terms of our health and well-being. Also in terms of our education levels, in terms of us being able to make our own decisions. And then, of course, the wider principle going forward mm. uh, being, being that fundamental issue around self-determination, the statement from the heart, and ultimately treating. Yes, exactly. Professor Chris, uh, how long have you been the president of uh, AIDA Association there? Almost two years now uh, I've been president and my term comes to a finish in November of, of this year. Yep. I'll hand over to my vice president. But, uh, you know, it's, we're growing as an organisation. We, uh, we do a lot of good work and uh, I'll put a little plug in for any of your, your younger listeners out there. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> then, uh, there's lots of opportunities at medical school and, and you know, dream big. Dream big. And look, you can't beat black on black when you're talking about uh, black doctors dealing with our mob. That's a great thing, isn't it? 
I've dropped off. Can you hear me? Yeah, now? yeah, you have dropped off. That's uh, Professor um, Chris Rala Baker, and uh, thank you very much, Professor. You did drop out there, uh, at COVID nineteen there on the phone. They cut us out, but it's all good. And uh, look, uh, he's with the uh, well, president with with Ada, and that's the Australian Indigenous Doctors Association. And talking about the uh, commitment from the uh, the uh, government, uh, the federal government, and also Victorian government, uh, and they will contribute uh, for forty six point five million dollars over four years with the Victorian government adding an extra three point $3 million to the funding pool. So, look, fantastic. Uh, we're heading in the right direction. I need to close the gap in all facets and, of course, in our health. First Nation people, stand strong, you mob. Add to the conversation here on National Talk Black. Yana with the ball around Trevor Tim, Trendy